Welcome. In front of me I have Garmin Phoenix 8 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the Android phone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your watch. We start, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your watch, uh, your watch needs to be paired with your phone. And also you will need to allow some permissions uh, for the Garmin Connect application uh, for the notifications to work. So, if your watch is paired with your phone, find the Garmin Connect uh, icon and press and hold on it to open this menu. Once the menu pops out, tap on App Info and here let's tap on Permissions. And we need to allow a couple of permissions. We need to allow the contacts if you want to receive the notifications for calls. So you, you will need to ena enable contacts, uh, call logs and phone. For the SMS, you will need to allow the SMS. And that's about all from here. So I'm gonna allow SMS, phone, contacts, and the call logs. You can also allow the calendar if you want to see the notifications from the calendar app. Okay, once you allow the required permissions, you can close this page, and now we can open the settings on our phone. So tap on settings. In settings, we need to find the uh, notification access or device and app notifications, depending on the version of Android you're using. On the older Androids, it's called notification access. On the newer ones, it's called device and app notifications. So you can tap on search and look for it, or you can uh, find the option called apps, then tap on special app access. And here you should see the uh, device and app notifications or uh, notification access. I'm going um, I have the device and app notifications option, so I'm going to tap on it. And that's how it looks like. And basically what you have is the list of allowed or not allowed apps. And what we need to do is to find the connect application, tap on it, tap on the switch next to allow notification access, tap on allow. And once you allow the notification access for the uh, Garmin Connect, we can close the settings. And now we can open the Garmin Connect application. In the app, you should see the home page. Now tap on more, scroll down and find the Garmin devices option. Once you find it, tap on it. Here, select your Phoenix 8 from the list of devices. Tap on the option called notifications and alerts. And tap on smart notifications. If the notifications are disabled, tap on it and tap on list on to enable them. And here we have calls, texts, apps, basically the types of notifications. Tap on calls first. And here we can turn on the notifications for calls or turn them off. We can turn on or on the sound for them and turn on or off this vibration for them. Next we have the texts and we can do the same. We can enable or disable the sound. We can enable or disable the vibration or we can enable and disable the notifications. And the apps is also the same. So adjust it to your liking. And once you're done with the types of the notifications, next we have the privacy option. This option allows you to select off, press start and gesture. If you select press start, you will need to press the start button to reveal the content of the notification. If you select the gesture, you will need to perform the wrist gesture to reveal the content of the uh, notification. And off basically keeps it turned off. Next, we have the timeout option, and here you can select for how long the notifications will stay on the screen after you receive them. And you have 30 seconds, 1 minute, or 3 minutes. And finally, we can enable the signature option. And once you're done uh, customizing the option for your options rather for your notifications, sync your watch with a phone by tapping right here on this sync icon. And once you're done sync, once it's done syncing, the settings should be applied, so it should be working. So we can go back. Now I'm gonna send myself a message on Discord to test it out. So let's send the message. And as you can see, we received the notification on our phone and also on our watch. If you miss the notification on your watch, you can uh, swipe down on the home screen or swipe up on the home screen to open the uh, 
notification panel. So it's down, my bad. So you need to swipe down from the top of the screen uh, to open the notification panel. And you can tap on the notification to see it. And you can also dismiss it, mark it as red reply. Block the app if you don't want to receive the notification from this app. And that's all, basically. So that's how you enable the phone notifications for the, this watch on the Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.